Welcome everyone. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. I'm wondering if this will be another episode of Real Authentic Reasonings. Because to be honest, I'll be just flowing. I'll be flowing through this video. Basically, what this video will be about is... I'm trying to think which one it will be because I have so much to share. I think the one that is ready to come out is worthiness. Why many of us have been feeling worthless. Yes, especially women. Especially us as women. And I can go back in my memory of when I used to feel that way. When I used to feel that way. And a lot of the feminines I've encountered on this journey, that's one of the biggest um topic on, on on the mind or we're feeling what 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 doesn't allow us to you know go further into who we truly are based on our feeling um unworthiness unworthiness why we feel unworthy it's a lot of reasons but one one of them in which i want to speak about in this video is um if you realize or if you don't know many of us don't know for us to find our worth it's about giving you, we have to give our worth but if we don't know our worth our our value or who we truly are there's nothing to give so majority of the time we've been going into experiences relationships with the demand of wanting to receive so because we've been wanting to receive we really don't know we will never find our worth or know our worth if we just want to take, if we just want to get, if we just want to receive. Because it's like you are receiving someone else's worth without you, with you just being, staying stagnant and not sharing of yourself from a worthy, from, from this worthy, valuable place. And the reason for this is, as I can say, I can go back in my memory of when I used to feel that way and something came to me for these past days when we live in an old way of operation it's like we're living in someone else's footsteps and when I say old way of operating for example we were born in a family and what we do is we adapt we adapt to that program we adapt to that way of being and throughout our life that's the program we've been living out our parents way of living um the way our friends operate if you realize we've been living and operating in this mask of others and we've been portraying or acting as if it's who we are but it's really not it's not who we are and for us to really know our worth and to give our worth to see our worth and our value because worth and value go hand in hand i will be using these two words similarly in this video worth and value goes hand in hand when you start to dig deep to find out who you are what you came to do what you are good at is that you were accumulating a value system within yourself no more walking in someone else's full footstep but you are becoming who you truly came here to be you are stepping into your own authenticity and stepping into your own path so what does your own path consist of who is you i would for example who is lunar lunar is a creative being i love to, i love to help others i love to cook i love to share information i love to spend time in nature i love to spend time with myself i used i love to plant flowers i love to garden so these are my value system um i am accumulating my value system and the worth is you sharing that what is it worth how if you 
if you can sit within your value system and you see who you are it's like you're tallying up and you you are tallying up your worth so upon you tallying up your worth what can you give out of your value system to others to make them a better person to make the world a better place this is what the worth and value is all about because if we stay in the old for example as i was saying why i used to feel that way the way i used to live and the footsteps i used to others footsteps i used to walk into for example my parents my mother their old way of being because she's doing the same thing she's she, she has been walking just examples walking in her mother's footsteps and then i came walking in her footsteps so it's like we're walking in everybody else's footsteps and that 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 will start to become very stagnant and keep us stuck in a loop of over and over again walking in somebody else's footsteps without identifying what 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 does my footstep look like who am i what do i have to offer you understand and if you realize th those footsteps we've been walking into we've been stepping into if they have been making us better we wouldn't feel stagnant and we wouldn't feel drained and we wouldn't feel worthless so basically it's about identifying questioning who we are what we came here to do what are what what are our gifts and talents mastering them going into them practicing them accumulating more energies around your value system accumulating more value within your being and that will be your worth what you are worth a lot of us don't know that we are the value a lot of us think is the money that we are working for is the value or the house that we live in is the value but we are the value those things came out of us you understand so when we step out in life when we step out in life and when we step out in life and we have already accumulated our structure a value system within this being wherever we go we would want to share whatever we do it's about sharing it's because once we share of ourselves and our worth and value you don't have to look to say what will i get because it's like everybody around us you will you will be able to identify who haven't been tapping into their value system because you see that they will want to suck from you so it's like whenever we whenever we tap into these these worthiness of ourselves we can see ourselves more clearer we can see our path more clearer we can see who we are even more clearer and what we have to offer to the world who, what we have to offer to others and we will stay open to receive so why we feel worthless is because we've been living in others old footsteps and we tend when we live in these old memories and old footsteps and old path and old programmings it's it's basically draining us because it's like we're moving further and further away from who we are so when we feel drained whatever experience our relationship or anything we go into we want to take we want to take energy to feed what we what has been draining us so it's a matter of building up ourselves building up our self-worth so we can give we can give freely without others trying to take from us because if you're giving you don't have to be looking to say who is going to take from me no you give freely and you leave yourself open to receive freely also so it's a matter of developing ourselves developing ourselves so much that we shine bright we shine so bright with value that we just keep overflowing with worth 
we just keep overflowing with value and it's overflowing so much we cannot do nothing but share so this is a message for all of us not just women but all of us but the reason why i tend to speak a lot more about women because we are mainly feeling this way when it comes to feeling unworthy feeling like we're not valued feeling like nobody value us but at the end of the day it's us not realizing that we don't know our value we don't know our gifts and talents we don't know what we came here to do we don't know our own path and this is where even studying ourselves astrology doing detoxes Whenever we detox the system, we leave ourselves open to receive fresh information from our authentic self, our higher self, to show us what we need to do to continue to build up this value system within ourselves, to share to the world, and to leave ourselves open to receive even more guided information, more value more energy more information more love more abundance within our being to stay on in in this worthy frame of being our state of being so guys worthy are being worthy are being valued it really definitely starts with self it starts with self and it's about seeing ourselves and realizing when we are on an old programming or parents old programming what type of programming you came here to live out and when you start to go into those programming that has been written up within you already already that's when you will start to feel worthy worthy of being in your body worthy of living the life that you came here to live not someone else's program, but the program that was written for us from within, from within the soul, from within the heart. Understand, guys? So let's start to develop and tap deeper into ourselves to see our worth, to discover our worth, to remember our worth and our value, our core value here on this earth plane, in this human body because in the spirit and in the soul has all the treasures that we think we don't know we don't remember we just don't remember so, so it's about going deep within ourselves to rediscover these values and these worth and use it on ourselves master use it to master ourselves and then share it to others who are in need of our value this is what it is all about and when, even when it comes to this is why it's really ideal for us to forgive our parents because they were our guides and they didn't have this information that has that is streaming in right now and it's a matter of forgiving them and looking at ourselves and know that all right i'm i'm an adult right now i cannot stay and keep blaming mommy or daddy what can i do to make my life better now what can i do to make my path what it should be to walk the path that i came to walk to tap into my worthiness and to discover my value and share my value to those who need my value so it's time to embody these treasures that lies within us embody them but first we have to discover them we have to dismantle all these old programming that has been holding us back from our true valuable worthy self true value lies within but we have to dismantle and rediscover and discard the old ways of operating because if you realize the old ways have been allowing us to feel unworthy so if it makes you feel unworthy it's old so it's time to dive deep into the new to discover who we truly are what what are our worth and how valuable we are as souls here on this earth so i wanted to share that and yeah guys just let's start to dive deep within ourselves and discover who we truly are and who we truly came here to be okay we are loved we are valued 
We are valuable. We are worthy. We are worthy to do the work that needs to be done for us to evolve, for us to ascend into a much more authentic, beautiful, radiant, soulful expression of source. So yeah, guys, wanted to send that out, sending lots of love. Be sure to subscribe, like and share this information. If it resonates, leave a comment and let me know what you think. You get me? Leave a comment and let me know what you think. And let's reason about this topic. Have you, oh, have you, have you been feeling worthless? Have you been feeling like nobody sees your value? Understand? Yeah, and if nobody sees our value, it's because we haven't been seeing our own value. We've been living in others' footsteps and programming to be little our value system and worth. So it's time to discover these treasures within, guys. All right? Stay balanced and much love.